Hi, what's up, y'all? What's poppin'? What's cracking it today? About to react to this vid. So apparently, DDG is the topic of conversation as of late. Um, he is now talking about being in a relationship and how it's a part-time job. Okay, so we're gonna hear what he has to say about this. People are on this man's head. Um, and apparently, a uh, close friend's Instagram post has been floating around where he said that Holly has trash head. But he has come out and said that basically he didn't he didn't post that that he doesn't even use close friends. So I don't really know what to believe honestly because people people be lying. You just can't believe everything that's being told to you. Okay, sometimes people are caught, you know, doing something they try to deny it like oh I was hacked or oh I didn't post that I don't know what y'all talking about that's fake, you know. And since it is a close friends post very few people who can actually vouch for seeing it you know if it was a public post then you know he couldn't pull that off and say i didn't post that because a lot of people would have been like yes you did i saw it on your instagram but since it's close friends it's like if he only had like i don't know 20 people in there and one of them exposed him he could easily be like nah because he probably trusts the other people so i don't really know you know i, I i'll believe him though if he's saying he didn't post it then sure he he said he, he didn't post it <laughs> But yeah, let's hear what he has to say about how being in a relationship is a is a part time job. Cause low key, I agree with this. <laughs> I agree with this. I'm gonna say low key, high key. I agree with this. Um, so I don't know what people are mad because apparently they are about whatever he's about to say. But I'll I'll hear you know how he words it and I'll give my take. Let's watch. Self something at age 22, I would tell myself not to get in a relationship because it's damn near like having a part time job, bro. Then you really have to apply a lot of time and effort like you might be doing videos all day and your girl get an attitude when you're doing your last video like nigga when you gonna take me out to eat yeah. when you gonna take me to the movies when we gonna go on a date and then it causes relationship problems in your real life that can affect your content you might get mad in the argument you might not want to film the next day might not want to stream the next day might not want to go to the studio the next day whatever like yeah. so I would tell myself if I was 22 I would say bro just grind it out let a relationship happen yeah but only happen when you feel comfortable in yourself as a man like yeah. that nigga is you cool part-time job like that sounds like you shouldn't be in a relationship if it feels like a part-time job freaking having a baby is a full-time job i mean that's true she sounds like ice spicy um i don't know why people are mad at that first off it's his opinion okay that's how he feels and he said he would tell his younger self that so it doesn't sound like that's his stance today maybe he doesn't feel that way now i don't know how dd how old ddg is now but you know he definitely said he would tell his younger self that um but bro i, I think it's a part-time job too okay <laughs> I do. It doesn't mean it's a bad job. You know, it doesn't necessarily mean that it is a miserable situation. Some people like their jobs. <laughs> it could be an enjoyable part-time job, but it, it is a lot of, of work. Relationships are work. And what is jobs? Work. <laughs> a job is work. So I, I don't understand why people are upset by, by this take. I, I totally understand what he's saying. There is a lot of energy that goes into a long-term relationship. And if you don't understand that, then you clearly have not been in a, a an actual relationship. I don't understand. But I'm sure, everybody's perception is different. So whatever. Whatever. If you want to look at it a different way, whatever. <laughs> sure it's your opinion and you know how you choose to to view things but bro you have to allocate time for this person you have to prioritize them even when you don't necessarily want to you know you have to consider them at times when you don't necessarily want to so there is a lot of responsibility involved uh when when you are in a relationship and you know it it does feel like a job at times to where you're like okay i have to you know take time out to do this and spend time with this person you know sometimes when you just want to chill sometimes you just want to chill and be by yourself but it's like oh let's hang out it's like okay <laughs> okay all right cool and it's like i like you you know or you know depending on how long the relationship is going on i love you so it's like all right you know i'm, I'm gonna do it but, you know, sometimes you, you want to, you know, just chill. And it's like, you got to keep them in mind. You know, sometimes you don't want to keep them in mind. So, I don't know. 
that's just how I feel about it. So I understand what he's saying. <laughs> and he's talking about his younger self shit. I, I feel like that just in general. But um, hmm. there's that. It's his opinion. People are now just just pressed for every little thing he's saying now at this point. Like, leave this man alone. Let him feel how he feel. Why do y'all feel the need to drag him with every single thing that's being stated? Like, if you don't agree, okay, sure. You don't agree. You could say, well, I feel like da-da-da. But to go as far as to be like, oh, nigga, no. Like, you you so stupid because you, you had a baby. So is that not a bigger job? And I feel like people are just making it personal and starting to attack him at this point. So... I just feel like it's getting a little corny, a little goofy. Um, but people are, you know, making him public enemy number one. I think they're really upset um, that he's no longer with, with Haley. <laughs> but, I mean, if they ain't together, they ain't together. What the fuck? How are we just going to blame him? You know, so I don't know. But whatever. People are, people are mad about this take, apparently. Let me know what your take is and how you feel about it if you've actually been in a long-term relationship. I'm not talking about a couple months where, you know, everything is rainbows and butterflies and you want to be around them 24-7. I'm saying when, you miss somebody, when you've been with someone for years, like, again, a lot of people speak on this shit and they, they, don't, they haven't had relationship experience. <laughs> I find that that's a very common thing. You haven't even been with anybody for uh, for years. For you to be like, well, you should love them unconditionally. What do you mean? You should want to be around them every day of your life, 24-7. And it's like, you clearly have never <laughs> been in any any long-term relationship talking like that. But whatever, whatever. Whatever, people going to lie. Like, I've been with my boyfriend for 20 years, and I always want to be up under him and smell his morning breath and be, you know, in the bathroom with him when he's shitting. And I don't ever want time apart. And it's like, all right, cool, you're going to sit there and lie. But whatever. Anyway. That's my opinion. Y'all let me know what y'all think, though. Let me know what other videos you're going to watch, and I'll see y'all next time. Bye!